how to create a loading text animation effect in DaVinci Resolve 18. Inside your Projects Edits window, open up the Effects menu. Underneath Toolbox, select Effects and go to drag a Fusion Composition Edit to your timeline. Select the Fusion Composition Edit, hold in Control or Command if you're a Mac user and press D to make an alteration to the clip duration if you wish. Right click on the Fusion Composition clip and go to Open in Fusion page. Inside your Fusion Nodes panel, hold in Shift and press Space. Use the search box at the bottom of the Select Tool window to find a Text Plus node. Select this and go to click on Add. Click on the grey box next to Text 1 and drag your cursor to the yellow arrow alongside Media Out 1 to make a connection. Ensure that either left or right view is selected underneath Media Out 1 so that you can see a preview of your video effect above your Fusion timeline. With Text 1 selected, go to Inspector and underneath Text, type in the word Loading followed by a space and a full stop three times. Go to Font and select the text style of your choice. In this particular example, I will use Bank Gothic MDBT. Keep the colour as white and adjust the size as you wish. Should you wish to change the location of the loading message on your screen, go to Layout, alter the center X coordinate to change the horizontal positioning and alter center Y to move the loading message vertically. Return to text, ensure that you are at the first frame of your video clip zero, which you can also identify by the red frame pointer on the Fusion timeline. Go to identify the right on property underneath text Click on the circle icon representing right on end and drag this to the left until all three of the full stops have disappeared from screen. Now drag this circle icon back to the right, letting go as soon as the first full stop appears. Select the keyframe diamond icon which appears next to the right on setting. By default the Fusion Composition clip will comprise of a frame rate of 24. I wish for the second full stop to appear after one second of screen time. Therefore I will skip forward to frame 23, return to right on and drag the end circle again towards the right, going gently and letting go as soon as the second full stop appears on your message. Jump forward by another second of screen time, here in this example I will jump to frame 47 and repeat the process of dragging the right on end circle delicately until you can see all three full stops. Advance forward by one more second of screen time here to frame 71 and select the keyframe diamond icon for right on so that we can see all three full stops for an entire second. To have the animation effect with the full stops loop, select spline. In the spline chart, tick right on end. Use the scroll bars if necessary to identify the four keyframe markers on your line. Click and highlight all four of these and go to select set loop. Close the spline chart. With the text 1 still selected, hold in shift and press space and go to add a scan lines tool. With this new node selected, return to inspector and underneath controls, change composite type to darken so that you can see the black lines appearing on your text. To make the lines thinner and increase the quantity of these on screen, increase line frequency to 20. And to make the whiteness of the text stand out more, cut the line width value by half to 0.25. Thank you very much for watching, I hope that video was useful to you. If you enjoyed the content and wish to be notified about future uploads on this channel, please like, share and subscribe. Join me soon for another video, take care.